Today, on Tractor Man 64, I'm doing something a little different. I'm doing a how to weather video. So, here I weathered this. Um, you can kind of see it, but I weathered this international, and it's got to be. I love it more weathered than I liked it uh, without being weathered. I weathered this tractor. It's kind of hard to see, but I did. And I've weathered a few over there, but we're going to be weathering this poor V8 and you're probably wondering what are you going to weather with. I usually weather with paint, but there's a new technique. Makeup. Weather with makeup. It does an incredible job of going on. So here we go. So I'm going to, you know, put some nice brown on here and just weather away and it really makes these tractors look incredible and in my opinion this is the best thing to do to a tractor that and um yes this could be a show tractor but I'm making it a field tractor and Usually when I weather things, I turn out liking them when better when they when I weathered them than I did when they were brand new. And there's a simple reason for that. It makes it realistic. Here, let me move this big makeup tray thingy because well the tooth fixtures fell. So anyways, so I'm not sure if you can see this, but it's starting to get weathered. So, um, sorry if my hand's in the view. It's just, uh, it's kind of hard to do a uh, video when I'm actually doing something uh, without my hand in the view. But, when I'm done, I will definitely show you how it turned out to look. And if you watch the beginning of the video, you'll be able to see what it looked like, like, when the beginning in the video when I showed uh, today I'm going to be weathering this tractor, you'll be able to see the, uh, when I picked the, I think I picked the, uh, the 1568 V8 up and showed you it. And then I'll do the same thing here, but for when it's finished, wet, when I'm done weathering it, which right now I'm getting close to it doesn't take long to weather a tractor <laughs> let me tell you that <laughs> and to me weathering them gives it a one-on-one -on -one, or wait no a real a really really realistic uh, idea and it and it helps give these tractors more more of a better looking uh, so right now I'm a better looking tractor and I'm using this tannish pout, this tannish, um, it's this color here. It's called, it's, it's that color right there and I don't know how it's going to look on the tractor but we'll find out. Um, it's like a, when I dab it on the it turns out to be like it turns into like chunks so i'm just gonna stick with the brown and it to me the brown looks a lot better too but working with tractors when weathering uh are pretty cool and i i really really enjoy weathering and now it's time to weather the back of these the, the hitch part of the tractor but yeah, if my hand's in the view, sorry. But, I'm finished. Really quick. There you go, you can see how it's weathered. The stack. <laughs>